How's everybody doing? There we go. My name is Kartik, one of the co-founders of ETH Global, and I'm excited to welcome all of you to Pragma India. This is a one-day conference. Now, you've been to a lot of these events before, and I want to talk about what's different about Pragma. Pragma is an event that's organized by ETH Global, and we do hackathons and summits all across the world. And we're obviously excited about ETH India starting tomorrow. But today is about talking about important topics in this space from the perspective of what you should care about and how you can think about the next few years. Every Solidity developer knows that the first thing you write when you want to build a smart contract is the word Pragma. For us, it's just not the beginning of a developer's journey, but also a call towards pragmatism. And that's kind of our goal. We want to make sure that we get to use this event to bring Web3 to a much wider audience and help them understand what's happening, even if they can't keep up with all the details. This is what it makes our event different. Pragma is one day and single track, which means this is the only place where anything will be happening. There's no side stage. There's no second room somewhere. There's no two things happening at the same time. Everything is happening here. The whole event is founders only. We want to have you talk, interact with, and learn from what the people who started a lot of these protocols are thinking about and what matters to them. And that's why everybody who's on stage is going to be a founder of that project. And the focus is on the future. We're not going to talk about how something has happened or what's going on right now. We want to use all those things to help understand what does that mean for us and how we can make better decisions in the future or even shape it to understand what the problems are that are still unsolved. And because there's a lot of you here from different backgrounds, we're going to keep it mostly non-technical. There's an asterisk there because there's one talk where you need to know some things about how staking works. And we're going to be covering how certain EIPs uh, are coming up and why they're important. But every, everything else, you don't need to know anything about math, cryptography, programming, any of that stuff. Our goal is to make that more accessible to all of you. That's pretty much it, and this is the best part. There's going to be zero talks today. Now, what does that actually mean? Well, it means that there's no go buddy that's going to be plugging in their computer, showing you some slides, and repeating something they've always repeated. We're going to make sure this is more of a well-thought-through conversation around interesting topics, which means the way today is structured is that there's going to be three panels on different topics. We're going to talk about Web3 infrastructure. We're going to talk about starting from hackathon to becoming a company, and we're going to talk about all things privacy and zero knowledge. And then there's going to be five interviews that will be one-to-one -one conversations with some of the founders on similar topics. I'm going to cover all of that in just a second. And you all already have a copy of this card when you checked in. If you flip on the other side, you'll be able to see who all of our founders are, who all the speakers are, and what these conversations are going to be about. And to make this interesting for everybody, everybody who checked in, and verify their wallet, you'll be receiving that graphic as an NFT for you to collect as a memorabilia for this event. Now, the best part. There's 500 people here from 27 different countries. We managed to get so many people interested who came here from all over the world for ETH India and Pragma, and we're gonna be making sure that you feel welcome and you get to understand what's happening in this space. And I also wanna quickly thank our three incredible partners, Coinvise, Filecoin, and Polygon, uh, they'll be here. They'll, they're outside with a, with a booth. You can learn about what they're up to, what they are excited about, and you also get to talk to them and interact with them, and there may or may not be some swag. Now, let's get to the good stuff. Everything I'm gonna say here is also available on ethglobal.com slash pragma, which is primarily the schedule. The website is up to date. If something is off track, it'll be reflected on the website first, and then we'll be communicating it here. And to kind of give you an overview of what the next few hours look like, we're gonna start off with a interview with Juan Benet from Filecoin, and we're gonna be talking about how we can use a lot of the stuff from Web3 to accelerate humanity. Our second piece today will be a panel that'll be moderated by Molly from Filecoin and Protocol Labs, and we're gonna be talking about how you can make your hackathon project into more than just a project from a weekend. Uh, we have some amazing founders here who all had their start at ETH Global and that we're gonna be covering about their journey, how they got to where they are now, and what were the things that were there in their minds when they were just hacking on a weekend project. Then our third panel of the day is going to be about understanding some practical applications of zero-knowledge proofs, privacy, cryptography, and how you can think about how to use these technologies and make it more accessible, and just make them even more practical. Then we're gonna do a panel on Web3 infrastructure as a service, 
how do we actually think about not doing all the things all the time ourselves? Can we use some different services? How do we think about offering these services? How do you compete with Web2 services on the same themes? All that good stuff for a lot of the Web3 infrastructure. Then we're gonna have our most technical talk of the day, which is understanding four different EIPs around staking and how you can understand what staking on Ethereum looks like over the next few years and what you can keep in mind and what you can do to actually even take advantage of it and build a company or protocol. We're gonna then take a one hour break. You get to enjoy some food, talk to everybody, including our founders. And then we'll resume the second half of the day, which is gonna be a few more interviews. So our first one is going to be an interview with Jason and we're gonna be covering all the lessons learned from building an actual company in Web3. Jason has been doing this thing for years and he has a lot of interesting insights to share. Then we'll have Rene as our second last talk, our interview, and he's going to be talking about what made Celo move over to Ethereum and become in layer two. We're gonna be diving into what's happened since the original an announcement. And then last interview of the day will be Sandeep, and we're gonna be covering some new interesting updates from the Polygon ecosystem and what the Polygon community will look like over the next few years. That's all the agenda for today. I wanna to just remind everybody that all of this is on ethglobal.com slash pragma, and you can see all the other details except the times on your postcards. So let's get started.